Hey, what's up everyone? So about eight months ago, I pre-ordered the VR room. I am upgrading from my HD Fury Arcana here. And the main reason I decided to upgrade is because the VR room will be able to project an image to multiple screens rather than having to switch out the cables. So with this overview, I'm gonna just give you um, details on all the ports and the cables and items that come with this. So on the front side of this, you'll see that there are four inputs. You have zero, one, two, and three. These are all HDMI inputs. You have your relay port, your IRRX, and then your IR sensor. We're gonna rotate this to the back side, and we have our power supply, our eARC audio arcana which is just for like your sonos arc if you have that soundbar or even a bose soundbar um, we have our hdmi tx1 hdmi tx0 and then our hdmi audio 720 to 1080p so i'll go over briefly what these four channels would be used for this channel here is from your sonos arc soundbar this one here would be for your TV or your projector. I actually used my projector port here. Um, this one here I have ran up to my television. If your television has a arc port on it, you can use this arc port and just have it plugged in directly to the arc port on your television instead of using one of your HDMI inputs. You can use this port to run from here to your receiver to be able to get all of your audio. So here we have our LAN control, we have our RS-232, and then there is an SPDIF left and right out here. So that's the device. There are buttons on the side to help you toggle up and down um, and then through the inputs. So looking at it from the front, this button right here toggles through these four front inputs, or if you're hitting the menu button on this side, you could go up and down through the menu items using those. There's a information button, and then this can also be used as an exit button. And then this is a menu button and a toggle button. So as you're going through your items, like scrolling up right here, you can toggle through to turn things on or off or change the setting on something. As far as cables with this, we have our optical cable that came with it. We have our IR sensor. We have what looks like a VGA cable um, with 3.5 millimeter uh, headphone jack. And then it came with a power supply. So this is a, a brick with this style power. On the Arcana, they used the USB-C uh, power supply on that so they changed that up on us so just to give you some basic information on this it does support 1200 megahertz at 40 gigabytes per second it has vrr qms qft uh, hlg the hdr 10 plus arc eARC, and imax the max resolution on it is 4k at 120 hertz and then for 8k it's at 30 hertz I'm running um, the Sonos Arc soundbar, two Sonos One SLs, and then two third generation Sonos subwoofers. The main reason I bought this was so that I would not have to swap my HDMI cable uh, from my television to my projector on a regular basis. Uh, the Arcana, absolutely a great product. Uh, felt like it was very simple. This is probably a little bit ahead of its time, but I wanted it and pre-ordered it and I'm hoping that it'll meet all my expectations. So hopefully you found this video helpful. Please feel free to like and subscribe and thank you so much for watching. If you have any other information for this particular box, please feel free to share it down below because I'd love learning things when it comes to this type of stuff. Um, I just wanted to share this so that it was clear on what actually is with the box, what comes with it, and um, just to give you a peace of mind. So thank you everybody for watching and have a great day. Thank you.